New at 6, you can weigh in on the future of the Institute of Texan Cultures, UTSA, asking for the public's input on what to do with that museum that stood at Hemisphere Park for more than five decades. RJ Marquez spoke with the UTSA, UTSA chair of the committee that's overseeing the next steps for the ITC and what options are on the table. It is one of the most iconic and recognizable buildings in San Antonio telling the story of Texas. The Institute of Texan Cultures really is about sharing the rich mosaic and tapestry that comprises Texas, not only the current, but also the future. The future of the museum, which was established in 1968, is up for discussion. This week, UTSA released a draft report that includes three different scenarios for the museum's future. One of which involves relocating out of the Texas Pavilion um, and, and away from the Hemisphere District. One of them involves relocating out of the Texas Pavilion, but remaining in the Hemisphere District. The third option is staying right here, and that includes redesigning or modifying the existing building. It also includes much needed renovations and upgrades to get the ITC to national accreditation standards like the McNay and Whitty Museums. The restrooms and accessibility and IT infrastructure that are all a part of meeting the standards for AAM to which we aspire. The next step is to get feedback from the community, conservation and preservation groups that will be presented to UTSA President Taylor Amy. An online survey is on UTSA's website right now and the process could take up to four months. And we have no doubt that our community, you know, how people feel about this varies amongst individuals. That's an opportunity for UTSA to be a good steward of the ITC, not just for the past 50 years, but for the next 50 years. RJ Marquez, KSAT 12 News.